Welcome back. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to change or add new fingerprints to your Android phone. This will work on tablets too, if your tablet has a fingerprint reader. You will be able to use the fingerprints you change or add to unlock your device or sign into different apps that support this feature. The method to change this might be slightly different depending on the device manufacturer, as some will run slightly different versions of Android. I'll be using a Samsung device, but whatever your device is, you should still be able to follow along. Remember to leave a like, and feel free to subscribe if the video helps. Let's get into the method. First head to the main settings page. In the settings, look for an option called biometrics and security. It might be called something slightly different, but tap on it. In here, find the option for fingerprints and tap on that. You will probably now need to enter your current PIN or password. After this, it should show you the current fingerprints saved on your device. You can tap on each of them to either rename them or remove them. You should also be able to add a fingerprint in here, and this option will probably be under the current fingerprints. When you want to add one, you will need to scan the fingerprint you want to add. For the best possible scan, adjust your finger or thumb each time you scan it. Keep doing this until it says 100%. Once you have reached this, you can either add another or complete the one you have just done. You can now rename it just like before. You might be able to turn on fingerprint unlock in here if it isn't on already. If you don't have that option within here, you can turn this on by going back to settings and then into the lock screen settings. When you next load up the apps that you have fingerprints set up on, you will likely need to enter your usual password to confirm that you have added the fingerprint. And so that is how to change or add new fingerprints to your Android phone or tablet. Click or tap the card on screen now to watch a video of mine showing you 10 easy ways you can speed up your Android phone. If you have any questions, then let me know in the comments below. And if you did find today's video helpful, remember to leave a like and feel free to subscribe for more tips in the future. Be sure to stick around to see some of my other videos that you might be interested in. Thanks so much for watching, and I will see you in another video.